Exodus chapter 28 You shall make the robe of the ephod all of blue it shall have a hole for the head in the middle of it it shall have a binding of woven work around its hole as it were the hole of a coat of mail that it not be torn on its hem you shall make pomegranates of blue and purple and of scarlet all around its hem with bells of gold between and around them a golden bell and a pomegranate a golden bell and a pomegranate around the hem of the robe it shall be on Aaron to minister and its sound shall be heard when he goes into the holy place before the Lord and when he comes out that he not die the golden plate and the turban you shall make a plate of pure gold and engrave on it like the engravings of a signet holy to the Lord you shall put it on a lace of blue and it shall be on the sash it shall be on the front of the sash it shall be on Aaron's forehead and Aaron shall bear the iniquity of the holy things which the children of Israel shall make holy in all their holy gifts and it shall be always on his forehead that they may be accepted before the Lord you shall weave the tunic with fine linen you shall make a turban of fine linen you shall make a sash the work of the embroider you shall make tunics for Aaron's sons you shall make sashes for them you shall make headbands for them for glory and for beauty you shall put them on Aaron your brother and on his sons with him and shall anoint them and consecrate them and sanctify them that they may minister to me in the priest's office you shall make them linen pants to cover their naked flesh they shall reach from the waist even to their thighs they shall be on Aaron and on his sons when they go into the tent of meeting or when they come near to the altar to minister in the holy place that they don't bear iniquity and die this shall be a statute forever to him and to his offspring after him